Reading could be adding an emergency shelter site to help address homelessness. Action News Now reporter Jordan Henry is live at St. James Lutheran Church. Jordan, how many micro shelters does the church want to add? Kelly, they can be adding four micro shelters like this one right behind me to house five people for one year, but that's if the city approves it. Take a look. This is a closer look at what the micro shelters look like. There will be four single story micro shelters and one double micro shelter. Along with the micro shelters, there will be a common area, kitchen, laundry room, and a bathroom area. But as part of the city's rules, people picked would only be able to stay there for 10 months. Steve Bate is a deputy city manager. He says it's the city and the church's goal to help people get into permanent housing, even if some neighbors don't agree. But one woman who lives nearby says she's seeing the bigger picture, which is to help more people get off the street. There's a lot of homeless people here, and I think we need more and more shelters and just more opportunities to help these people um, and just show them like, like we're here for them as well, even though it's like hard and like everyone's on their own, that sometimes it feels like that. But I think doing the little things goes a big way. There were, I mean, there's of course, some opposition um, from a few of the neighbors and you know I think what backs that up is that you know this they have a solid operations plan um, they're providing you know on-site management of the facility uh, you know and, and making sure somebody's at least there on call and there's rules I mean there's rules for these folks to abide by the emergency shelter site would cost about $338,000 and would be funded by grants and donations. Bate tells me if the city decides to move forward with the emergency shelter, the city still has to get approval of the church site plan. And Bate tells me that church site plan should take all the way until the summer to finish and then construction can start. Live in Reading, Jordan Henry, Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. Jordan, thank you. Those micro shelters would be built by the California Heritage Youth Build Academy Charter School by students and instructors.